All right, I heard a, uh, I got silver. It was that deep, I just popped it out. No. I thought I missed my signal. Greetings from Kentucky, and we just crossed over the Ohio River into Illinois, and we're meeting up with a local YouTuber, fellow detectorist named Brian. He's going to show us around. Let's get right to it. Oh, and I have no idea where we're going. I think we're just going to knock on some doors. Hopefully, Brian has some permission scoped out, but this is going to be a surprise for everyone, I think. So in addition to being surprised by our guide, we were surprised by someone you might recognize from previous videos, our friend Jeff from Colorado. All right. Jeff just happened to be out in Kentucky during our trip and decided to join us for a fun weekend of metal detecting some historic sites in Illinois. <laughs> What's you up, look bud? familiar. How you doing, bud? Good, how are you? Man? Good, good. We're in Illinois. I know. <laughs> we're in freaking Illinois. <laughs> this is insane. Seriously. Okay, we're at an undisclosed location right now, That's but right. Uh, we're waiting great. for our, our guide. Yes. Brian, yes. to show us around because we have no idea what we're doing. I'll wait for our guide and see what happens. I'm pumped. I'm pumped too. I'm pumped. No problem. What a yeah. beautiful state you live in, oh, man. Thank you. There's some others. Northern Illinois and then there's Southern Illinois, right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> right. Just want to clarify that. Yeah, no, I got you. Yeah. All right, so we're going to follow you? Yeah, you ready? I yeah. think so. Love yeah, it. yeah let's go. Let's go. All right. Can't say what it is. All right, so Brian's on the board here. The first uh, artifact. Got a weedy. Older. Yeah, I think it's a 19, it? 19 teens, right? That's a good weedy in the box. My pull tab. Oh, look at that. It says try again. <laughs> <laughs> I found two of them like that. They're mocking me at this point. Uh, no kidding. Good job. <laughs> Thank you. All right, I just want to show the house. Brian here got another weedy. What'd you get? I see 30. Nine? Yeah. That's been on the edge. Nice. What a very good signal. All right, on to the next. All right, so Jeff's on the board with the, the car. That's right. Here Ooh, that's an older car. Here on the side of the house. Yeah, yeah. I think the act the... Oh. Oh, but just broke the axle right that's off. That's why you don't... Yeah, that's been in the ground for a while. For a little bit, yeah. That's well, like, I'd say, 40s, 50s? Yeah. That's what I would guess. Yeah. Very nice. Off, that makes it look like big bricks, spread that's... Oh, Jeff big. just found it looks like a baby spoon. I remember those. Yep. I mean, not from when I was fed, but oh, like when my little sure. brother was, you know. I think it might be the same one. Somehow it ended up here. My little brother's baby spoon? Yeah. That would be weird. <laughs> Good job. Thanks. Man. Yeah. All right. And Jeff here got a... Some rounds. A sweet piece of metal is what it is. Yeah. Could be a slug. Twisted metal. It's really, really thick. Yeah, it is. I don't see anything on it. Any ideas? Fatty Indian. You usually know. Yeah, you would think. Fatty Indian. Yeah. <laughs> Look at how fat <laughs> that, that would be. That's fat. <laughs> that's a fat, fatty Indian. No. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know either. It's, it's a round piece of metal. But I was pumped. I'm, I'm still pumped. It could actually, be something. I actually know what it is. It's an Ides of March. I had to mark. Token. I don't know if you've heard of that. Good job, man. Yeah. <laughs> Give me my toothbrush. Like, stop right. talking. <laughs> it feels like a bale seal. It's lead. That's what it feels like. It feels like a bale seal. Okay. So they would have clamped that like after they packaged up like some yeah. some uh, bales of whatever, and then. I think we may have. I think it may have brought dirt in here at one point. Oh. Know, it may have I been just, back in the '60s, you know, I or just, something like that. But I just it's a. Uh, yeah. I think we got field dirt here because we're not you, finding anything. You old. went down a foot to get a wheat penny or a like, memorial penny? Yeah, like a memorial penny. Yeah, that sounds, that sounds about right. Maybe we can try and replace. It's yeah. old though, but see that coal chute? I mean. Yeah. Yeah, let's look at that coal chute because that is, you don't see those too often anymore. Yeah, I found I found a couple of deep uh, memorials too. Yeah. Well, we'll keep looking. There's houses like this everywhere though. I know. If, we don't, if it didn't get any better, let's move down the street. Let's just move on. All right. All right, I heard a, uh, I got silver. Hi-ho, silver. What'd you get? Look, it was that deep. I just popped it out. No. I thought I missed my signal. 
I couldn't find it where it was at, and I thought that was it, and it wasn't. I just thought, well, I'll pop that out, whatever it was, and it was a murk. No way. Look at that. Got some water? Oh, you got, oh, he's got the, he's got it. Go ahead and rub it. Sorry. Oh, I get to rub it? Okay, okay. <laughs> get to do the honors? Yep. All right. What is it? Uh, I still can't find my other signal. <laughs> let the camera do the work. 19. Folks at home will probably see it better than I can. 1919. 1919. 19, cool. 19. That's incredible. Let me. Uh, awesome. Congrats, man. Thanks. Yeah, congratulations. Thank that is you. awesome. On the board. On the ride. I know. Peace. A little bit of like cuff button. Yeah. Ooh, that's an old one. Yeah. See, that's that an there. old one with the shank the on it. It's like it's a two piece. Yeah. That's nice. Maybe it dry out. I, mean, I don't know if I can see anything on it. I can't it. see anything on it. You got it magnified too. Uh, I don't. I don't. Yeah, even up close, I don't, I don't see anything. May not be. May just. But that's odd for a two piece not to have something on it. Yeah. You know, because it is two piece. You can see the. Oh yeah. I can see the. Unless that's Intact just a design, chain. where but it looks like a. We did a line around the side. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah. That is an old button. Okay, so this is one of the few properties where the uh, front door is open, so I don't mind taking a little look around. I don't want to... Have a safe word when you go in there. Have a safe word? Okay. Uh, um, banana. Foliage. Foliage. Oh, yeah, I don't think I want to even step foot in there. But, yeah, all the furniture is in there. Look at that. Back in the truck again. We're gonna go find a different spot. All right, different property. And I just flipped coin out. I don't know if you can see that right there. I think it's a quarter. I think we got a modern quarter. Yeah, eagle back. All right, that's better than what I've been doing <laughs> most of the day. On to the next. All right, so Jeff just pulled this little guy out. It looks like looked like a really large caliber ammo yep I'm thinking cosmetics blinged out shotgun shell there you go I like it like the general shotgun shell yeah yeah all right all right well here's the wrap-up got a couple new cars one of which is a Tootsie this giant scrap of iron some more scrap down by the river Jeff got some really cool stuff got a little baby spoon this neat little piece, looks like there's a star or something decorative on it. Yeah, this is okay. just cool, it's got a little mother of pearl, a little brass piece with mother of pearl in it. Jeff also got himself a new car today. This is what he's driving back to Colorado in. The wheels fell off, we're digging it out. Oh, we can, put the, we can put the wheels back on. Uh, we think this might be a bale seal. Uh, got a few Wheaties, one marble. Got that rimfire cartridge, dude. Oh, that's right. On room fire. I think I got some ammo too, but and Brian just nailed it with the find of the day. It's 1919 Mercury Dime, Philadelphia. A few Wheaties. Good job, Brian. Good job, Brian. Yeah. Got himself a new house. I like that. I think that's the find of the day. Or the Titchy. I like the Titchies too. Oh, you hear that? He thinks these are the better finds. I don't know that. It's, you got silver. Yeah, but you got silver. Some of these relics outweigh silver. That's true. Then your button's cool. Yeah, I like two that piece. Button. Oh, yeah, that button's all right. I like that too. Late? What do you think? Late nineteenth century? I don't know. It's odd. Like I said, don't have nothing on it. Usually, two piece always had something on them. Yeah. Well, maybe we'll find something when you get home. Yeah. Very cool. You got a loop. I'll look at it. Well, folks, that is a wrap for Cairo, Illinois. Huge thanks. He's cutting up because take one didn't go very well. Uh, huge thanks to Brian. Uh, Family Treasures, Metal Detecting. Mm -hmm. You said you're not active right now, but the channel's still up, so check them out. Family Treasures, Metal Detecting. Awesome day, guys. It was a fun Thank day. you so much. Thanks for driving all the way out here just to meet up with us. That's what it was. <laughs> That's what it was. That's what it was. <laughs> 15 hours. But thanks again to Brian for, for taking us out here. We just had a great day. It wasn't the best hunt I've ever had, but it was the best hunt in another way. We're in a different place. Tons of history. If you get a chance and you really want to go down a rabbit hole, check out Cairo, Illinois. It looks like Cairo. The locals around here call it Cairo. Anyway, great day. Thanks again, guys. Yep.